I received the following letter, quote, This is the second marriage for myself and the third marriage for my wife, Marta. We argue all the time about money. I make a pretty good living as a professional, but it seems like she spends money without even thinking about it. If any of her children or grandchildren or friends or anybody she's ever heard of needs anything, she buys it for them. She has a loving heart, that's one of the reasons I married her, and she loves to do things for other people, but she just can't say no to anybody. She can't do it with her time either, so she's always running around doing things for people and trying to make somebody happy. In the process, I get left out of everything. Then if I say anything about being neglected, she blows up. Recently, I tried to talk about a budget and she blew up again and stomped out of the room. I give her every penny I make, but it's never enough. If I told you how much she spent on Christmas gifts this past year for every person in her extended family, you wouldn't even believe it. But still, she accused me of being cheap. I'm terrified of this next Christmas season. What can I do?" End quote. You describe your wife as having a loving heart, implying that what she's doing with her family and others is loving. You believe that she's buying all these gifts and spending all this time doing things for people because she cares about them. But that's not true. Yes, she's doing the best she can to love people like we all are. But on the whole, she is not offering people unconditional love, which is the only thing that qualifies as love. Everything else is garbage and does not deserve to be called love. In other words, your wife is not being loving. I'm not criticizing Marta. I'm simply describing her behavior. Instead of being loving, she's buying the conditional approval and the affection of other people with her money and time and attention. Now, how do I know that she's not just offering these things freely, that she's not genuinely being loving? Because of how you described her behavior. For one thing, she spends more than she has, more than she can really afford. In other words, she's spending desperately, intensely trying to earn the approval of others. And then when you suggested that she spend less, what happened? She blew up and stomped out of the room. She knew that if she had to limit her spending, she couldn't buy other people's praise and approval and power. And then she'd have nothing. She literally went into a fit of withdrawal like an addict would do if threatened with a withdrawal of their addictive substance. People who are simply offering their love freely do not go crazy if you suggest that they stop offering it for a time. No, she's compelled to constantly be giving people money and time and service so they will like her. It's a trade. She's buying them off and I'm not criticizing her. In the absence of real love, what else could she do? It's all she knows and it's a very common behavior. Marta's fits of anger are more than just a sign of her fear and withdrawal from addiction and we'll talk about this in our next session. <music>